probably their most athletic lineup they can put on the floor, trying to match the athleticism of South Sudan. Oh, getting caught on the back screen, Kwani Kwani. This is good movement now for South Sudan to get a wide open look for the perimeter. The three is good for Colic Jones. Shot selection continuing to be a very mysterious one here from the Philippines. Mario Shaya can make this a 10 point ball game, and again, South Sudan. Jones going all the way, throws the alley-oop, and when you, Gabriel, well, went up with a bit. It's a good job there by South Sudan, but look at the alley-oop. You ride Juba Airlines. Juba finds Dwight Ramos, turns it over now. The guy below is Colin Jones going to go up, and he finishes this one under pressure. Bad shots leading to runouts here for South Sudan. Jump go for a step back. One second left. Jones and the shot clock with the dagger. And again, doing what they do best. Here against Gilas Filipinas. Coach, the perimeter shooting. They have been on fire so far. Jones going behind the back. Dang, Akkad doesn't take many three pointers, but why not the big man? Match up with the opponent's best player. But when you're Gabriel getting the first field goal, and that's what South Sudan missed. Not using the screen and by Colin Jones. Good defense by Colin Jones. And now look out below, ladies and gentlemen. Here comes Dem with a two-handed jam. Tyler offense stayed in the hands of Dwight Ramos. Again, a tough move by Jones, and he gets the have one. It's just the inexperience of Renzo Mondo. Big time play from Carly Jones, sensing the moment there. South Sudan able to spread Gilas out, so they didn't have Soto there at the rim for protection. Jones seeing that going coast to coast for the layup. Another Spanish pick roll scenario coming again. Jones going all the way and exploiting the Gilas defense. Congratulations to Carly Jones. Well, I know, dear friends, that it's not exactly the evening that you were.